Gaura Premanandi. On this verse, Srila Prabhupada, the founder of the International Society for Krishna Consciousness, of which we, were, we are representing, he writes, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu personally traveled to different regions of India to spread bhakti throughout the country. He also personally relished transcendental activities. By his personal behavior, he has given an example for devotees to follow. That is, one should broadcast devotional service all over the world. He specifically instructed his devotees to enjoin all Indians to broadcast this message throughout the world because at that time the Lord could not personally travel to other parts of the world. In this regard, he has left two instructions. Bharata Bhumite Vela Manusha Janma Jara Janmas Chartak Kari kara para upakara. All Indians should seriously take up the teachings of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and should perfect their lives by adopting the process of devotional service. After perfecting their lives, they should broadcast this message all over the world for the welfare of all human beings. That 
fabulous uh, history of, of, of the Bhakti movement. Fabulous to hear it in such sequence. Thank you. Uh, there's a great lineage of uh, bhakti teachers or gurus. And all of them have contributed immensely to, uh, and we're indebted to them, really. Any of us who practice kirtan, uh, which is becoming very popular around the world now, um, even uh, simple things such as vegetarian sometimes we take for granted, really that vegetarian movement started really taking off in America after the 60s, and Srila Prabhupada was one of the proponents really uh, preaching this vegetarianism, kirtan, uh, this lifestyle, this bhakti lifestyle. Um, so whether we are, we find ourselves within this lineage or not, still, we should acknowledge our the debts that we have to these great teachers, offer them our respects, and uh, chant and be happy. So, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.